Hey, music lovers, question. Have you ever experienced quadraphonic sound? For those who haven't, it's an immersive experience that sounds like you've been dropped inside the music with the sound coming at you from all sides. For those who have experienced quadraphonic sound, get excited for four new releases in Rhino's Quadio series. Drum roll, please. The titles are Average White Band's self-titled second album, Gil Evans' Svengali, Randy Newman's Good Old Boys, and War's The World Is A Ghetto. This week, we're taking a look inside these undeniably classic LPs before you jump into the Quadio experience that's sure to blow your mind and ears. I'm Scott T. Sterling, and this is The Rhino Report. Now, technically speaking, Quadio is 4.0 surround sound which utilizes four audio channels connected to four speakers positioned at the corners of a listening space. The multi-track audio is mixed dimensionally, submerging the listener in an expansive soundscape. The new collection is available on January 19th as Blu-ray discs with both a quadraphonic and 19224 stereo mix. As for this round of Quadio releases, Scottish funk group Average White Band's self-titled second album dominated the charts after its 1974 release, with the hit song Pick Up the Pieces peaking at number one on Billboard's Hot 100. Now, despite the Average White Band being decidedly Scottish and white, the AWBLP was a crossover smash enough to get heavy airplay on black radio in America and soaring all the way to number one on the R&B album chart. Wars The World Is A Ghetto was the 1973 Billboard Album of the Year, loaded with soul jazz classics including the Cisco Kid and title track The World Is A Ghetto. Full circle fun fact, The World Is A Ghetto was released in the quadraphonic format on 8-track tape, no less, upon its original release back in 73. Renowned jazz composer and arranger Gil Evans released his live orchestral jazz album Svengali in 1973, featuring a star-studded lineup of jazz musicians, including Ted Dunbar, Howard Johnson, David Sanborn, and more. Fun fact, the album title Svengali is actually an anagram of the artist's name, Gil Evans. Randy Newman's 1974 concept album, Good Old Boys, explored the social and economic issues of the Deep South and found commercial success, peaking at number 36 on the Billboard 200 and featuring the tracks Louisiana 1927 and Every Man a King. Speaking of Every Man a King, the track featured Three Eagles, Glenn Fry, Don Henley, and Bernie Leadon on backing vocals. These are transferred from the original half-inch four-channel masters at 192.24 resolution and sound amazing. Considering they've been in the vault for 50 years, the tapes were in pristine condition and needed no tweaks or fixes. They sound as fresh, rich, and powerful as the day they were created. Rhino's Quadio series will continue to dig deep into Rhino's archives to reintroduce the greatest hits from rock, blues, R&B, jazz, and more in their highly anticipated quadraphonic sound. Audiophiles can expect even more amazing quadraphonic experiences from Rhino in the future. Question, what album would you most like added to the Quadio series? Hmm, inquiring minds want to know. So leave your picks in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, The Rhino Report.